Hello products, programming students. Uh, in this video you're going to learn how to access the practice tests for both the Gmetrics uh, Python certification and the Gmetrics or the Microsoft MTA Java certifications. Um, I'm going to go ahead and include both of those practice tests in one access code so that um, my students that have both Python and Java uh, AP Computer Science Java can access both of those with just one login or one access code just to make it a little easier for you. So the first thing you want to do is log into your Gmetrics. Once you're logged into your Gmetrics and you might be looking at your dashboard which will show your recent activity. Um, go to redeem and then type in the access code that you see in Canvas on your particular page for this week. Uh, type that access code in and then click the redeem button. I'm going to pause the video right now so that I can type the access code in and when I come back I'll show you what your dashboard will look like after that. So once you type in the access code, <coughs> excuse me, once you type in the access code and click the redeem button it will take you to this screen assuming that you'd like to take a test. So you can go ahead and start with the practice test from here. The way you would do that is click on Microsoft Technology Associate and then you will choose the one that you want to use and so you will see uh, you probably will not see these two but this is uh, my student account so that's why these two are on here um, if you're interested in taking the um, Microsoft Software Development Fundamentals course in the future that are that is encompasses these two certifications software development fundamentals and database administration fundamentals so Python students you want to focus on this one introduction to programming using Python and Java students you want to focus on this one introduction to programming using Java you simply just click on which one you want to do and then you choose which test you'd like so notice for Python there are two tests and both are offered in training mode and testing mode now I will tell you that there are some questions on the Python test that um, are incorrect. The answers are incorrect. So when you get to those questions, if you if, if it looks a little funny, uh, let me know and we can talk about it and I can tell you what it's supposed to be. Uh, then if you wanted to go back, of course the Java has three practice uh, or two practice tests and then don't worry about this one. That's one I just created to uh, help a teacher at, uh, out. As a matter of fact, I think you guys will not actually have access to that, so you won't see that at all. Okay, so you'll just see the two Java tests if you're a Java student, and the two Python tests if you're a Python student. All right, hope this helps. Good luck to you on your certification. Bye.